This is where we find all the good stuff. Hold on. Use your lantern to light the lamps, Connor. They'll help us find our way should we get turned around. I wonder why they built these tunnels. Yeah, this tunnel is crazy, yo. Excellent. Let us move on. I hope I'm going the right way. Much as it pains me to say it, we must follow the rats, as they often move in the direction of an exit. I believe this is the right way. Yeah, what are you talking about, Sam? Huh? I found the right way. Well, well. You were right. I apologize for ever doubting. No wonder Achilles has taken such an interest in you. Ars. I don't suppose lockpicking is part of your repertoire? He's like, get out of the way. Let a man handle this. Lock work. Just gotta find the right. Hold on. Where are you? There you are. Okay. Got it. Well done. The printer isn't far. Let us reconvene there. Lying low. Very short mission. <laughs> Shortest mission in the game, definitely. Getting one step closer to wearing the robes. And then I believe all the suits pop up. Alright, so the tunnels... Wait, what just happened? Oh, I can't enter the underground, okay. No worries. Just gonna go down here, nice and easy. Printer shop. Let's go. You ask a great deal of me, Sam. I know, but I wouldn't be here if it wasn't important, if it wasn't vital. Fine, just this once though. In the future, such things will come at a price. Resetting the type is neither quick nor easy. To say nothing of the cost should I be discovered. I shall not forget this kindness. Nor I. His work will see your last little bit of notoriety erased. Come, I'll show you how to leave now that order's been restored. So, now you've had a chance to see how it all works. Untoward actions will upset the citizens and inevitably lead to the guards being called. Depending on the severity of your transgression, they may simply search a bit before giving up and returning to their post. But should you offend them severely or repeatedly, they'll become much more aggressive in their pursuits. I've shown you three ways to turn the tide. Remove wanted posters, bribe town criers, or visit a printer to create your own propaganda. This feels wrong. Why not just speak to someone and explain my innocence? You can't be serious. We counter one lie with another. Words on paper instantly taken as truth. 
and all of it without question. They loose this beast, or have you forgotten? I merely helped you tame and turn it round. There must be another way, something more honest. For well, when you find it, do let me know. But until then, we sculpt with the clay we have. My apologies. I do not mean to sound ungrateful. Quite all right. I was much the same at your... Here we are. Speak with the harbor master and he'll see you home. Thank you for everything, Sam. I promise one day to repay the favor. Oh, I'm counting on it. Like this. Aww. It's good stuff, man. Alright. Let's go home. Thank God for fast travel. Now, now truly, fast travel is here. Now, in Assassin's Creed. It's very confusing in Revelations, but now... Fast travel is so much easier than it ever has been in Assassin's Creed. And it all started with three. Oh man, I can't wait to sail on that beauty. Look at the reflection in the water. That is so sick. I can't remember if that was there before or not. Man, I love being in the snow, though. Same thing with, like, Valhalla and everything. Sorry, Mr. Cooney Coon. I gotcha, buddy. What the heck? Did you see? What the? Where did you come from? Did it just build another freaking raccoon? Let me try that again. Oh, I just got two. Well, that was interesting, wasn't it? All right. But yeah, I love being in the snow. Even in Valhalla, I loved being in the snow. It was so much fun. Very bright, but very fun. This makes me wonder how it's gonna be in the next Assassin's Creed game. Mirage. Look, he's got the box. I wonder what's in no and what what's in that? <laughs> Welcome back. You left me in Boston. The training we've done here is all well and good, but experience is a better teacher by far. What of my father? Into the wind, I'm afraid. We have to find him. And we will. After the house has been repaired. But he's out there, plotting who knows what. And what would you do when you found him? If you found him? You're a boy with a few months of training. He's a man, full grown, who spent decades honing his skills. If you're going to stand a chance against the Templars, you're going to need these. Ooh! Go on before I change my mind. Achilles' hidden blades. Hey. Now Connors. Oh, I love this mission. The river mission. Oh, so much parkour in this. What's funny is that he's just like staring right at him. Sir, please help! He's going to die. River rescue. Oh, there's no time. Please come. Dang, really? All right, we're good. I was about to lose him for a minute.
Down there! He's just past under the bridge! Here we go. Time to save him. Already messed up. Oh my gosh. Honestly, I want to redo that, but it is what it is. Go, 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 go. Sticking to the side. I'm coming, buddy. Stay put. Oh, man. No. Terry. Terry. I'm sorry, buddy. I think I went on the wrong side now that I mention it. Now we're on the right side. But I'm pretty sure we we're supposed to be on the other side <laughs> when all that happened. I'm coming. Here I come! <laughs> That's funny that he's just diving again. <coughs> what this knobbend is trying to say is he's forever in your debt, sir. Who are you calling? A knobbend? You, because you are one. What were you doing on those logs? One of the dangers of lumbering. We've got the camp set up a few rods off of here as we're cutting timber. We're hoping to open a mill in the area. There's a good place not far from the manor on the hill where I'm staying. <laughs> I like you already. We'll have a look. And there you have it. Short but sweet mission. Even though I messed that up completely. My goodness, I butchered that mission. <laughs> I'll miss the peace and quiet, but we can certainly use the wood. The manor needs a lot of work. That and other things. Meet me at the small shack by the shoreline when you have time. There's something else you need to see. What is it? An asset. Oh, we know where this is. Recruit new settlers. I have all the items I need. Thanks to the Ubisoft Club. So I won't need to be doing any of that. Yeah, you play Ubisoft Club is so awesome, man. There's just so many fun unlockables you can do. And when we get those suits, yo, you already know. I'm gonna be switching back and forth through suits. I can't wait to play as Altair. Like, like, not as Altair, but, you know, in his suit. That is going to be really, really fun. Alright, I know I'm supposed to go down the hill, but I kind of just want to low-key swim. <laughs> Let's go. You know, I really like the swimming in this game, but I also really love the swimming in Assassin's Creed Black Flag. The water is insane in that game. Which, of course, it makes sense because, you know, pirates. <laughs> and he's a pirate assassin, so... Just get me a ship and a 
true, and we'll find out what it was he held so dear. I met him once, that chappin. He was seven feet tall if he was an inch. I tell ya, the legs like tree trunks in a smithy's arms. Almost broke my hand shaking a little dough. I could feel it then when I met him. No weapon made by man could harm him. Go away! Say, go away, boy! Do you not speak the king's English? Oh, I didn't see you there, old man. I'd have set my home in order if I'd known you'd be calling. The boy's name is Connor. He's here to restore the property. Restore? Restore? Pardon my manners. She's still the fastest in the Atlantic. Sure, she needs some attention. Minor things, mostly, but with a little affection, she'll fly again. Who is she? Who is she? Why, the Aquila boy, the ghost of the North Seas. The boat. A, a boat? She's a ship boy, and make no mistake about it. I thought you brought him here to restore order. I reckon he's the greenest thing on the frontier. Connor, meet me back at the manor when you've finished here. You said it requires repairs. You able? She does need work. A ship is a she, boy. And yes, I can refit her, but I'm lacking in the proper supplies. Some, some quality timber would help me get started. I can see to that. How long before it, she, is able to sail again? Just get me the lumber, boy, and I'll raise a crew. Can do. The Aquila, that was the name of the ship. I love how I played this game like five times and I just can't remember the name of the ship that we set sail on throughout the entire game. I wonder if they added anything that we could sail on the, the jackdaw. Hey, didn't I kill you guys before? You can live this time. They're back from the dead. It's all good. I guess raccoons have two lives. I feel like right when they started, you know, with the sailing and everything in this game, that's when they had the idea, or maybe, like, they maybe have had it before, but the idea of pirates. <sighs> there you are. I have something to show you. Come, take a look. What is it? A ledger. It lets us manage the homestead's dealings. And these? Uh, that was years ago. Before the slow fever, before the Templars, before everything collapsed. But that's all in the past. Better we focus on what's in front of us. Take up the ledger, and I'll teach you how it all works. Stockpile, yep, okay. Let's get the max, why not? Never go back. Trading menu. Yeah, and that's, yep. It's when you do the missions and everything. There we go. Send convoy. Easy mission. <laughs> now it's time to set sail. I believe this is the last step. Time passed quickly after that. My days a blur of study, training, and work. 
What little free time Achilles allowed me was spent learning about the Templars, about Charles Lee and my father. I longed to confront them, to put an end to their schemes, to ensure my people would remain untroubled and free. But I knew it was too soon, that to approach them now would see me killed. All my work would be for nothing. Patience, restraint. These proved the most difficult subjects for me. But in time, I mastered them as well. Days became months, months became years. And as my skills and knowledge grew, so too did I. Love it. All right. Here we go. Let's set sail, shall we? The hard way. Come aboard and feast your eyes, boy. No, 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 no. Not the left foot. Never the left foot. Horrible look. Step with your right foot first. She is... solid? Aye. Weatherly and sleek. She'll fetch twelve knots in a stiff gale, ne'er a ship from here to Singapore can outrun her on her best day. What do you say we take her out and show you what you can do first hand? Where would we go? As it happens, she still needs guns and the officers to command them. We'll launch straight away. <laughs> Don't worry, lad. I'll make sure you sprout good sea legs. All in the mainsail! Get up the rigging! Hand over, fist! Come on, men! Let's get her out where she needs to be! We out of here, baby. It really is a big ship, to be honest. <laughs> Come on, lad, no time like the present. Take the helm. Taking our sweet time. Come on time, boy. It's time you learned. Come on, come on. She won't bite. You have sail. Ah, your killer flies again. Do you feel it, lad? Set a course for Martha's Vineyard. We'll find our guns and officers there. She's a nimble vessel, but the faster she goes, the more cumbersome she grows. And the firmer your hand needs to be. Enjoy this stretch of open water before we come upon those shallows. Call for full sail if you like. Full sail. Wind looks to be shifting. Stay alert, Connor. Dusty winds can be difficult to manage. Gotta go to half sail again. That's how we manage it. Imagine if I <laughs> just ran myself right into the rocks. Probably be funny, wouldn't it? Now, take us through these shallows. Careful not to run up on them. The sandbars will slow us down, but the rocks will put a hole through a hole. And if you want to make a quick tack, call for half sail. She's more maneuverable then. Yep, 
Yeah, I feel like the water should have been a lot nicer in this. In terms of gameplay aspect, like... In the cutscene, it looks great, but when like, when it comes to the gameplay... Hold your tap to keep your right of way. Bring her in to half fail. It just seems really bland. Not very, like, lively. And I believe Black Flag fixed all of those problems. And that's when they started getting water just perfect. <laughs> Woo, look at that boat going, man. Feels good. Oh, easy, easy. Let's go a half sail real quick. Smooth sailing. Full sail. No wind yet. Ah, there it is. Cottages. We're close. Bring her in to half sail. Full sail. Yeah. Love it. Dark at the pier. Drop anchor. We'll go ashore, buy our guns, and find our officers. Oh, I remember what Connor does here. <laughs> You're looking every bit as ravishing as I remember. Hmm. After all these years, you sail all the way to the vineyard to pay me compliments. We are looking for David and Richard Clutterbuck. Hmm. Nice to see you too. Robert Faulkner. Where the hell you been? Sorry for leaving like I did, lads, but where I was going, no one could know. You two working much? No. Between contracts at the moment. Well, we're looking for gunnery officers. What would you two say to working with me again? We'd be for getting into a few more scraps. <laughs> Good show. The Aquila is a fine vessel. We're fitting all the guns as we speak. Looks like your friend's about to catch a beating. Here we go. Where is Charles Lee? I don't much care for your tone, boy. Hey, you don't want to be doing that, Biddle. Bobby Faulkner turned to wet nursing. <laughs> it's good you finally realize you're a shite sailor. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not in here, gentlemen. Better still, not at all. Bobby, take your friends and get out! Let's go, boys. Our guns ought to be ready. Come on. <laughs> Lady was giving him the stink eye. for some of that ship combat. Let's get it. I love how it just popped up randomly. Out of nowhere. All right. What the bloody hell was that about? The older man is a Templar. Who was he with? Templar. The young buck was Nicholas Biddle. Nobody. Sails before the mast. Midshipman for the crown. Are the guns ready? Aye, but we won't jump in over our heads. We'll find a suitable target and show you how they work. 
We've fitted her with a modest amount of guns to start, but rest assured there's ample room to add more should you feel the need. Oh, we're entering in now. Looks like a British frigate with half seas over. Should do nicely for a spot of target practice. Bring around broadside, and when all guns are on target, call fire. Woo, here we go, baby. Round shot for a start. Fire! Well done, boy. Now, aim all guns at her bow and do as much damage as possible. You got it. Hold it. Let's go. Some old powder in there. Good. Now give the swivel guns a turn. More precise. Hit those old powder Gun powder. Barrels right up the sky. Oops. Missed. <laughs> Got it. That guy was so happy. <laughs> you are a fast learner. Provided something interests me. Ah. Getting a taste for the open sea, are we? We'll make a jack tar out of you yet. Now we should be getting back. The old man is like to have my hide for keeping you out so long. Oh, it ain't over yet. We about to get into something real. Why is he shooting at us? Eat this. Crown, Yo, first try? Peace, take your pick. What do we do? No else but to fight back. Sink the bastard. Easy peasy. English frigate. I'll be big swattled another one. Where in the bloody hell did she oh, come from? Oh, man. Brace. Brace. All right, buddy, you asked for it. Eat this! That's some damage. You're done. You're not looking so good, mate. Uh-oh. Brace! Wow, they weren't even close. Okay. And fire! Okay, think we're good? I think we're good. Oh, they're gonna try and ram us? I don't think so. Not today! Yeah! Oh, shit. Okay. Not bad for your first voyage, eh, boy? Now we best be getting back or the old man will have my guts for garters. Now we have finally gotten a taste of the open sea. Love it, man. And you know what that means. You know what comes up next, everyone. It is finally time. Not gonna say it till we see it. 